Nice working with you, kid. Real nice. Thanks. I don't know what to say. Welcome to Watch Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 old superhero shows that deserve a revival. I've got to agree with Beast Boy. It sure is good to finally be back home. We'll only be looking at animated programs this time around. Number 10, Batman Beyond. I wouldn't blame you if you stayed home. Not after what all those ingrates have been saying. I didn't get into this for gratitude. I have a feeling you didn't either. In a not too distant future, an elderly Bruce Wayne quarterbacks from the Batcave as the young Terry McGinnis confronts criminals as the new Dark Knight. The youthful hero had a colorful rogues gallery that kept him on his toes. This isn't how I wanted it. You were supposed to give yourself up to me. You should have gotten it in writing. And we never got tired of seeing Terry glide through the Neo Gotham setting. Although the third season wasn't as strong as the previous installments, the show still didn't deserve to end there. A Batman Beyond revival could introduce new threats and explain what happened to old allies like Dick Grayson and Superman. Terry could also have team-ups with other heroes and get a Neo-Robin of his own. If this Batman soared again, we're confident fans would embrace his future legacy. He saved the world. Think you can get used to it? You're saying you want me with you full-time? We could really use you. Number 9. Fantastic Four – World's Greatest Heroes You had best watch your tone. You know not who you deal with. Namor, read, don't. Nor do you, Submariner. Marvel's first family returned to the screen for a well-animated and thrilling adaptation at the turn of the century. The series did a great job at capturing the titular team's personalities and using their powers in creative ways. I said stop! Unfortunately, a random airing schedule and network jump made it very difficult for anyone to follow the Fantastic Four's adventures. Since a live-action movie is scheduled to be released in 2025, now's the perfect time to revive the troubled animated show. Not only could the program familiarize audiences with the team, but it could incorporate villains like Galactus long before he's adapted to the screen again. A revival that incorporated what worked while taking big risks could make the Fantastic Four feel like the world's greatest heroes. This ends now, Namor! You dare! Yes, I do. And now you will listen to me. Number 8, Danny Phantom. There's not a ghost anywhere that can stand up to Danny Phantom, the original Teen Ghost Fighter. After getting into an accident in his parents' lab, Danny Fenton gained ghostly abilities. Over the course of three seasons, we watched as he matured as a hero and became more powerful. The series ultimately ended with him saving the world and revealing his identity. Although it was a feel-good conclusion, the creators can scare up new stories based on our lingering questions. Well, gang, there's good news and bad news. The good news? My powers are back. Bad news? My powers are back! <laughs> Did everyone around the world accept Danny after he revealed his secret identity? Will another villain try to take advantage of the ghost zone? And after a few years of ghost busting, does Danny want to hang up the jumpsuit? These questions and more are just begging to be answered in a continuation. And I probably won't see much of you anymore. Oh, I wouldn't count on that. Number 7. Gargoyles Goliath, I say take all your gargoyles and make sure they're gone. I can scare those cards away without any help. This beloved Disney series was once praised for its fantastic characters and unique premise. During the show, we followed gargoyles who were stoned by day and lively crime fighters by night. After two strong seasons, executive meddling led to a lackluster third and final installment. Hi, Lisa. Every time I think we have arrived at a safe and stable life, it is abruptly torn away. But neither fans nor creator Greg Wiseman seem to be content with how the series ended. While viewers kept searching for answers about what happens next, the architect of the show has continually contributed to comics and outlined new arcs. There is more than enough material out there to free the animated gargoyles from their stone prison again. While the news of a live action series is great, the original show still needs time to shine. This castle is our home, no matter where it has been taken. We will stay here. Excellent. Number 6, 
The Spectacular Spider-Man. There's not enough money in the world for me to turn a blind eye to your great works. Keep the light on. Cause I'm coming for you. The 2008 Webhead series blew fans and critics away with its nuanced storytelling, complex characters, and amazing action scenes. After two superb seasons, the show creators planned on at least three more seasons and a couple of movies. But the spectacular Spider-Man's web ended up being cut far too soon. Come on, Venom! That's the best you've got? I'll stick with the red, torn, and blue! After the rights to the series were essentially split between Sony and Disney, neither company was legally able to continue the story. Since the short-lived series ended, fans have had to settle for a spectacular cameo in Across the Spider-Verse. We know Disney has plans for other Spidey shows. However, we think there's enough room for another webhead to swing back onto our screens. Spidey's not a disease that needs a cure, and he's more than just a random bug bite too. Spider-Man is who I am. My destiny. Number 5. Justice League Unlimited. What we have here is a rare opportunity for me to cut loose and show you just how powerful I really am. While we love seeing early career heroes work together on Young Justice, we'd love to focus on the veterans for a revival. Justice League Unlimited brought popular and obscure characters together to fight classic rogues and completely new antagonists. This formula led to plenty of unique team-ups. Additionally, the show excelled at setting up epic narratives that also had lots of humor. If nothing else, I can at least learn the Flash's secret identity. I have no idea who this is. Since the series alternated between self-contained stories and multi-episode plots, a revival could easily start us off on a clean slate or kick off a winding tale. The possibilities are practically unlimited for this superhero show. Hopefully, the League will get a chance to save the day again. When this is over, it's back to business as usual. Wouldn't have it any other way. Number 4. Green Lantern, the Animated Series <clears throat> Kinda figured you'd turn up here, hotshot. Just your style. You bar the ship, rush into danger, catch the killer, save the day, big hero. Well, you forgot get the girl. Hal Jordan and many other members of the Lantern Corps impressed audiences when they appeared in this intergalactic series. The characters and their various powers were brought to life with stunning CGI animation. Underneath the crisp visuals, viewers were treated to deep cosmic plots that set themselves apart from other superhero fare. I stole the ship she was trapped in, broke her out of Scar's lab without giving it a moment's thought. And now I either destroy my friend we lose everything. The groundbreaking series was cut short due to factors such as lackluster merchandise sales and the failure of the 2011 film. Fans have been deprived of a focused Green Lantern show since the former series was abruptly cancelled. Instead of starting from scratch, DC could continue right where the short-lived show left off. The network just has to be willing to embrace the might of this epic series. Know what you gotta do, right? I will do. What must be done? Number 3. The Avengers, Earth's Mightiest Heroes You are Earth's Mightiest Heroes, and I've called you together for one reason. The end of the world is here, and it's our job to stop it. A few of the planet's fiercest fighters initially came together to stop dangerous escaped criminals, but the team eventually stayed together to deal with world-breaking threats. During this Avengers series, viewers got to see a great roster of heroes star in tight and action-packed stories. The series also brought in plenty of iconic Marvel villains that pushed the protagonists to their limits. I am Thor the Thunderer, son of Odin, Prince of Asgard. But today, above all things, I am an Avenger, and this world is under my protection. After a strong two seasons, the writers plan to expand the team, introduce X-Men, and kick off a Ragnarok event. But the show was disassembled in favor of a new Avengers show in 2013. While the second program was great on its own, Earth's Mightiest Heroes still had a lot more to offer. You ever stop to wonder how history will remember us? I never have, but now I can't shake it. Number two, Teen Titans. Look, this may not be the perfect team, but it's all we've got. We're the Teen Titans now. If we work together, we can accomplish anything. 
An anime-inspired art style and focus on a teenage team immediately set this beloved series apart from everything else in the genre. But what really kept fans engaged was the fact that the series balanced everything perfectly. The show wonderfully blended dramatic tales and comedic stories. Additionally, each member of the team was fully fleshed out and given the opportunity to take the lead. While there were a variety of reasons given for the show's cancellation after season 5, diehard fans didn't care about any of them. Did you think we wouldn't take it personally? It's over, Terra. Viewers and critics celebrated the brief return of the original Titans in a 2019 movie. The warm reception there should be a big sign that if a Titans revival is built, fans will come. I feel so much better. <laughs> that was uh, trying, to say the least. Am I right? Before we revive our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Beware the Batman. Budget issues allegedly prevented this unique Dark Knight from staying on our screens. I apologize for the theatrics, but I had to be sure that the Cortex was operational before you could intervene. Ra's al Ghul, you're gonna wish you stayed in hiding. Iron Man. Fans would love to suit up beside Tony Stark for more armored adventures. Yeah, well, that's why they pay you the big bucks and give me all the bonuses. Look, Julia, whatever my chances may be, they're a heck of a lot better than Clint's are if I do nothing. Freakazoid. This short-lived superhero parody would have plenty of material to work with today. Hey, Freakazoid! The other writers and I think it might be more fun if you could use the uh, Freakmobile in this chase. Todd McFarlane Spawn. This dark and brooding series could shine if given another chance. As far as I know, I'm already dead, which means I'm waiting for your sorry ass in the afterlife. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Spider-Man The Animated Series Shocker's Blast should have creamed me, but it didn't. It can only mean one thing. My spider powers must be returning. For a generation of fans, the first wall crawler that they saw on TV came from the 1994 series. The five-season show incorporated great comic book storylines while creating original tales that continue to stand the test of time. Every victory, defeat, and lesson led up to a multiverse finale that ended on a massive cliffhanger. We are going to find the real Mary Jane Watson. What? It has been a long, hard journey, and I think you are finally entitled to some happiness. But the time may have finally come to continue the story. The Spidey show notably crossed over with X-Men the Animated Series. Since the latter show enjoyed a successful revival in 2024, it's likely that the 1994 webhead could succeed today too. The 20th Century Spider-Man brought a lot of people into the Spider-Verse. It's only right that he gets to return and see how far the genre has come. I've always wanted to experience real web-slinging, and I've always wanted to be appreciated as a real hero. It seems you've made me into one. Thanks. What superhero show would you revive if you had the chance? Let us know in the comments below. Just like old times. Except better. Let's finish this. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.